Hi there, my name is Aditya and I'm a product manager at Adobe. And today we're at the Google campus and I want to introduce you to Flash Player 10.1 running on an exciting new product from Google called Google TV. There are a ton of great features on this product, but the essence of the experience is bringing the web to your television. And of course, Flash is a key part of that. Flash delivers over 75% of web video, and what a better way to experience that than actually being able to view it in the comfort of your own living room. But Flash isn't just about video. It's about games, social applications, rich internet apps, just to name a few. So let's take a look at some websites running on the Google TV. So David, helping me off screen, is going to help drive while I show you some of the websites. First up, we have BBC here. And this is the BBC's uh, web video player. This is their standard desktop site, watching this uh, NASA Atlantis shuttle arriving at the space station. You can see all the standard controls, including one to go full screen. So as we go full screen, you can see this web video now running in the full glory of actually running on a TV. All the same controls you have here, like play, pause, volume controls, are all available delivered by Flash Player. As I go back down to regular size, you can see again that this is just built in an integrated experience inside of your television, inside the web browser. Now, the ne what we want to show you next is Adobe's YouTube channel. Adobe's YouTube channel has hosts and showcases a lot of videos that Adobe's produced. And what we want to show you is a video that we've taken and produced at 720p. On Google TV, it's decoded using the hardware, so you get a great, full, rich experience as if you're watching broadcast HD content. So this video is loading, and we're going to take it up now to 720. You see it running in the context, again, of a regular website. Now, the power of the experience is actually being able to take this HD video and go full screen. Now, you can see the web now running on your TV, giving you broadcast quality content delivered via Flash Player, a rich kind of immersive experience, which you would expect from any kind of broadcast content that you'd have running on your television. Next up, we want to show you Google Street View. Google Street View is a great feature of Google Maps that lets you actually look at the street of an address that you're looking at. The Street View feature is delivered using Flash Player. Now we're going to take a look at Adobe's office in San Francisco. We have a map here of 7th Street, and now we're going to go down and actually take a look at how the street looks itself. Street View is delivered using Flash Player, and Flash Player here enabled inside of Google TV helps you actually look around the street here. So you can imagine before you head out somewhere that you actually might want to take a look at, you know, there's parking or anything like that else available. So I can pan around and see what's available around here. Very easy, very seamless to use, showing the power of Flash Player integrated inside your experience on your television. Now, the living room is a great place for children and parents to be able to experience educational content. And that's exactly what the PBS Kids website enables. Through the PBS Kids has a game called Curious George's Mix and Paint. Mix and Paint is an application that lets families play color painting games. So now you can see the experience that David is driving, uh, showing how you can actually put together colors and paints and pictures, helping children learn how to actually put these things together and understand how colors mix and match. Next up, what we want to show you is a gaming kind of application. This is on Facebook is very popular for delivering so games that are hooked into the social network. So we're going to show you Games That Give. Games That Give is a company that enables charitable contributions through letting people play online games where they donate part of their advertising revenue towards charities to help them achieve their goals. In this game, Bouncing Balls, as I match the color in the balls, I move up and get more points. Every point that I get takes me closer to 40,000 points where I'll actually help a child in need get a polio vaccination. So this is another example of the kind of content you know, available on social networks that actually helps drive an amazing experience on a Google TV. So you can see Google TV plus Adobe Flash Player allow for an uncompromised access to the web. If you're a developer and you want to learn more on how to optimize your content for this and for other devices, visit adobe.com slash go slash optimize. If you want to learn more about Google TV, you should visit google.com slash TV.